Local designers are getting to unveil some brand new looks on the runway this weekend, and these creations go beyond fashion. They're works of art. And as the Now Buffalo's Rebecca Thornburg reports, it's all for a good cause. Models will be strutting down this runway starting at 6.30 on Saturday. They won't be wearing normal clothes like I am. They'll be wearing designs you can't even imagine that are wearable. Crazy outfits out of paper plates, garbage bags, and it looks like a beautiful dress from far away. And you get up close and she's like, yeah, it's a garbage bag. Seeing somebody else think of something that creative really makes you challenge your mind. Caitlin and Brandon Mock are brother and sister designers and models in this year's wearable art runway show at the Niagara Arts and Cultural Center. It's a nice way just to have everyone showcase their talents in the community. It's truly really like a, a unique event and it's personal to everybody involved. They get to showcase, you know, what means something to them. The number of designers and the size of the space has doubled for the show's second year. Wearable art event, it's a fun fundraiser. Uh, you can come in, you can have a beautiful experience with great people and to support the community in a way that you'd never expect. The money raised will go directly to improving the Niagara Arts and Cultural Center here on Pine Avenue in Niagara Falls. More than 200 people are involved in bringing the show to life, from makeup artists to a stage crew and of course the designers themselves who have spent countless hours constructing the unconventional designs. And they did it is an inspiration to someone else. That's all we ever do. And when you see a problem or you see a challenge, you have to imagine a world a different way. And that is the heart of art and the heart of fashion. Tickets are still available online and will be sold at the door. Reporting for the Now Buffalo, Rebecca Thornburg. Rebecca, thank you. Very cool. Well, the next time you visit MLK 